Alrighty, Sharp Customs. Friday night here in southern Ontario was a beautiful day. Uh, showed you a little short video of working on a little diesel heater. Here it is right here. Got it all back together. Uh, stripped the whole thing apart. Had a little bit of uh, carbon buildup inside the heat exchanger. Dumped it out. Um, had some gunk in the exhaust tube. Uh, got that out. Kind of burned it out, I guess you could say. Um, fired it up in here. Seems to be working fine. Didn't throw any of the uh, E8 codes. And by the way, I just want everybody to know with these little cheapy diesel heaters, you know, a couple hundred bucks, that everything that you do to it, a fuel pump, a clog, uh, it throws the same code, just so everybody knows. Um, so it's working good now, fires up good, heats up good, ran it on low, ran it on high. Um, so, promised everybody, don't forget, before I go forward, we're rolling. Sharp Customs, share, like, subscribe. I know you hear it every video. You'll probably hear it every other video. I promised another video tonight. Uh, this pretty little thing sitting here on the floor said we were going to fire it up. And, uh, like, it is a Friday night, and, uh, I want to put a heads up to all my new viewers. Thank you for subscribing to Sharp Customs. Cheers. I'm going to have a drink. We got some lifters to set on this. Now, I'm a little redneck. So, as you can see, this valve cover is cut. I like to set my lifters with the motor running. Now, we've got some open headers on here, as you can see. Um, so it's a little loud. So I can't really hear the lifters clack, but I can go by feel. Um, and it's going to get me close. The motor's... Uh, the timing in the motor seems pretty good. Uh, I'm going to have a little sip. Cheers. And we're going to fire this up. I'm going to set the lifters. You're going to get to hear it. It's going to be loud. We're going to have the exhaust fan on so we, uh, you know, we don't die. Uh, we do have, we do have a fire extinguisher. We've got the battery, we got the fuel tank. Uh, one thing I wanted to show, we were firing this thing up earlier. I had this cable on the starter as my power, and it got a little melty. It, got, it was a little too close to the header. We had some arcing going off on the header. We had some weird sparks flying off. Uh, kind of one of the craziest things that i ever seen. Uh, hopefully that doesn't happen in the video because uh, I like to say stay safe and I don't want to have to carry a can of fuel out the door on fire. I don't want to do that. So I'm going to have a little sip. Cheers. We're going to fire this beast up. I'm going to set those lifters. You're going to get to hear it. You're going to get to see it. Uh, I do it pretty quick. So let's do it. I'm going to put my glasses on so I can see what the hell I'm doing. We've got a hot wire off the distributor. I'll hook that to the positive. Make sure nothing is touching. Uh, we got one wire here. It's a little close to the header. I'm going to move it. These wires are so long. I'm not using these wires uh, for this motor. Okay, these things are 
Oh god, look at look at the twist and twine here. We got snakes. We got snakes on the motor. Who put the M and F and snakes on the motor? Yeah. To hell with that. Let's fire it up. We're gonna give it a little prime. We're gonna fire it. Move this battery just a little, a little closer.
Well, we're, we're still below 140. We didn't heat her up too bad. Uh, now, if I, if I check inside the head, or on the top of the head, uh, we're pushing like 185. Not bad. I don't, I don't run them too hot on the stand like this. We didn't have any meltdowns. We didn't have any crazy fires. I'm gonna pull this fan. And pull this fan so you can hear me. Uh, yeah, it's steaming a bit. That's that's pretty normal, you know, for running it on a stand. It's got lots of residue still in the block, the cooling. We've got oil everywhere. We'll clean it up before we put the uh, chrome valve cover back on it. Uh, Hope you enjoyed that. I got a messy floor here, all oil. I got to clean up. Um, that motor sounds great. Uh, you know, once we get an exhaust on it, a couple mufflers, uh, maybe get it in the truck. It'd be really nice to hear that thumper cam. Uh, I don't care. Motors sound great with open headers. There's, there's just no two ways about it. You know. I had to rev the shit out of it just so you guys could see it, you could hear it. Um, we're going to keep this video fairly short. I think it's already gone on long enough. But uh, Sharp Customs, share, like, subscribe. I promised you this. You got it. You got to see it raw here now. Till the next video. Peace. I'm out.